guys, welcome to the DMX Show. I'm your host Shane. Today I'm going to show you guys how to unbrick your Asus Transformer Prime. Now the most common brick that most users are experiencing is once they've unlocked the bootloader, once they've installed a custom clockwork mod recovery or twerp or whatever and you've gone in there and you've made your modifications, you've played with it for a while, maybe you've flashed another ROM and then maybe another ROM. Somewhere along the line it gets stuck in Clockwork Mod Recovery. Now this is actually a pretty easy uh, brick to overcome. You're going to need some knowledge of ADB and I'm going to show you guys how to do this. If you follow my tutorial it's going to be simple. Uh, most of you should already have ADB installed if you've used any of my tutorials on the Asus Transformer Prime. Uh, if not you can check my channel on how to get it set up. I have one on how to get it set up for the Galaxy Nexus. It works the same on the Transformer Prime. Uh, but we'll go ahead and move forward with this. So this would be the screen that you're stuck in. Uh, this is your Clockwork Mod Recovery. So I've got my USB cable plugged in. And we're going to go ahead and get out of this brick. So the way that we're going to do that is we're going to open up a command line. And just type CMD. That will bring up our command line. Now you can do ADB devices to make sure that it sees your device. And it shows that we're in recovery. We're in our brick. We're in recovery. So I'm going to give you guys a link in the description that's going to give you the written tutorial so that you can copy and paste into uh, ADB. So I'm going to go ahead and kind of zoom in on that so you can see what we're what we're typing in here okay so the first thing it says here is you will open your CMD line and you'll type ADB shell so ADB shell okay so when the number sign appears there uh, you will just type Actually, you can copy and paste the command lines that are on that written tutorial. Just copy, paste, and hit enter. And then you'll go to the next line. Copy and paste that. And hit enter. It says exit the shell and reboot your Prime via Clockwork Mod Recovery. Uh, so now we will just click on the X here. And we'll go back to the Prime, and we'll just reboot the system. I guess we can go ahead and unplug it, reboot the system, and hopefully we have recovered. Now, if you have gone into that brick, it, it's not necessarily the, a problem with the ROM that you were on or the modification that you were on that caused it to brick. It's just something that these devices tend to do. So hopefully it should just boot right up now. Anyhow, we'll watch this for a few minutes. And if you follow that step-by-step -step process, that will unbrick your Transformer Prime. This is taking a while here, so I guess we'll just wait a few more minutes. If we don't get anything, I guess maybe it's possibly wiping the system. I'm not sure what it's doing right now. Just kind of watch it. Okay, it says that if you're stuck on the splash screen, you can boot into recovery and reinstall your ROM. So the way to do that is to hold the volume down and the power. So we'll do that. It looks like we're stuck at the splash screen. And it should come back up and give us our, our line of code in the top right corner. Okay, now we can hit up. That's going to put us into recovery. From there, we'll just install a ROM. So hopefully you had one on your SD card. If you didn't, um, then you can, of course, go into mounts and storage and you can mount the SD card or mount the system I should say and you, you can drag and drop thing if you mount the system with your USB cable plugged in you can drag and drop something over into there I'm going to go back real quick and we will just install oh just any random any random ROM here just to get it to boot up so I'll just go with bone stock and install that. Just give it a few more minutes here, let it do its thing. I just want to show you guys that uh, there is light at the end of the tunnel. And you've not bricked your device completely. 